What's up guys, welcome to Ty's Tech, this is the Tech News. And as you see, I got myself a little haircut. What do you think? And today we're going to talk about the first Google Android car that was just announced. And I uh, will be hitting the streets April 23rd and will be announced at the Beijing Auto Show. The name of the car is the Row 350, hopefully I'm pronouncing that right. Just in case I'm not, it's spelled R-O-E-W-E. -E. Road vehicles are more like luxury cars produced by the Chinese company SAIC. The technology that they are using in the cars are purchased by MG Rover, which has actually been owned by Ford and BMW in the past. The car will be running Android 2.1, the same uh, version of Android that the Nexus One and the Droid runs, and it will be built into the car's GPS system. Now, of course, it works just like any other GPS system, but you're supposedly supposed to be able to browse the web and do some sort of internet video chatting or something like that, um, which would be kind of dangerous while driving. I don't, I mean, I like that cars are advancing and stuff, but it's kind of dangerous and I think it's going to cause more accidents. Whether it's going to be able to support apps from the Android market yet, we don't know. It's not known yet how the internet connection is going to work. Maybe they'll go through Verizon, AT&T, uh, companies like that. Maybe you'll be able to use all of them. Maybe they will lock it to a certain carrier. We'll have to see. No exact price has been announced on the car yet, but it's supposed to be somewhere between $10,000 and $19,000. I know if I get a car, I'm going to want Android installed on it. How awesome would that be? So let me know what you guys think about this. Will you be getting one of these? I highly doubt it because these are expensive things. These aren't something like you can just go buy. But would you like an Android car? If you're going to get your first car, would, it, would you want it to be an Android car? Let me know in the comments what you think about this. Do you think it's going to work good? Do you think it'll be good? What do you think some features they're going to integrate with it? What would be some cool features they can integrate with it? Let me know in the comments. I'd like to hear what you guys have to think. See you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate five stars and subscribe. Peace.